Hello, my friends. It is that time of month. It is the time we get to share with you three new stamp sets. I'm very excited to share these stamp sets with you. They are lots and lots of fun, and they have to do with one of our other stamp sets. They kind of coordinate, well, they coordinate a lot, actually, so I'm very excited to share them with you. Are you ready to see them? Here we go. And you know I love to play this game. I never know which one to show first. So I will show the one that I was teasing you about in our video on the first of the month about our, remember this one? You're getting them in the mail as we speak still. They're going across the United States and across the world because we have club members in all parts of the world. Scream for ice cream. Well, this stamp set coordinates with Scream for ice cream. And it's funny because when I design the stamps, I'm like, oh, but I also need this. And I design the stamps because I'm a stamper and I design them and I say, oh, well, I need this because, it, you know, like I needed a mini, a mini cone and um, ice cream because, you know, you want to make a little border or you want to make something on the inside of the card that matches the outside of the card. And so I'm always thinking like a stamper. I'm, I'm not, I don't think like a graphic designer. I think of like a stamper. So it's a little different. And so like, I always have these extra things. Well, I only have this size sheet to work with, but then I came up with all these other ideas that I had to have as a stamper, so I'm like, well, I have to make a whole new stamp set. So this one was born. It's called Cone to Dish, and it has an ice cream sundae dish, and it has a waffle cone, because you'll notice that this one has like a regular kind of cone. Well, I also needed a waffle cone, right? Right? So these ice cream pieces fit on top of these two. So the waffle cone or the ice cream sundae dish. Now the ice cream sundae dish kind of came by, um, um, I was planning this ice cream set, but my friend Melanie, hi Melanie, up in the Bay Area, and I were talking about new stamp sets, and she had mentioned an ice cream dish, and I thought, oh, wouldn't that be fun? And I think you thought of something a little different, Melanie, but this is kind of my version of what I kind of came up with. So there's my ice cream dish, and so now I just added more things. So got ice cream, what's the scoop? Um, we all scream for ice cream, every day's a Sunday. Now look at this funny shape over here. What could that be? Well, you know what that is? That's the top of a spoon. So if you were having an ice cream sundae, that top of the spoon fits right onto the ice cream so it looks like the spoon is actually in your ice cream. I'm excited about that one, I love that one. So lots of fun stuff. Oh, well, of course, a cherry on top because we always have to have a cherry. And you'll notice, again, I have this funny little squiggle line. It's smaller than this last line. And remember I shared with you that that squiggle line is so you can cut out a little piece of a different color to add the topping. So this squiggle line is a little smaller so you could add now another color or another layer of topping. And it's just kind of one of those stamps that I just had a little tiny bit of room and I wanted to fit something in there and I just thought it'd be cute to add another layer of topping. So I'm always trying to think a little bit further and take it another step. So I'm very excited about this stamp set. So if you have Scream for Ice Cream, you're gonna want Cone to Dish, okay? I'm just saying. Okay, and I have samples to share with you in a minute. Now, which one next? This one, all for stars. We needed more stars. We have a star set already, and it's lots of fun. This one coordinates with that one, so make sure you check out the website for that one. Now, this one has a lot of fun stuff because it has one of my favorite stamps, Zebra. Zebra print. I am going to South Africa in September and I'm thinking all about these animal prints. So I needed a zebra print. So there's my zebra print. Then this swirl on this star, of course, matches our swirls to build stamp set. So now you can have, you know, another star to add to that collection. This one says, it's your turn to shine. You're my star. You rock. Um, you're a rock star or you're a star, all star. This one just says star. So this could be like a 4th of July stamp set. It could be a, hey, all star set. You know, when you need, when somebody needs a little pick me up and you want to just send them a little card that just says, hey, you're a star, you know, make sure somebody feels really good. And then these are two different stamp sets, just so you know. So this is one and that's two. And then these are also separate too. So there's lots of fun stars here that you can mix and match. And also they're different sizes. So you can kind of play with them, make them a puzzle kind of thing. Now, the last stamp set to sh I have to show you today is really fun. It's called Letters to Color. Now, you'll remember back, and you can check out our website in our gallery, we had a Numbers for Cake stamp set. The numbers had little candle tops because they were candles for the cake set that we have. Well, 
everyone emailed me like crazy. I got so many requests for this one. We love the numbers. The numbers we've actually had to reorder because everybody was so loving those numbers um, that they wanted those numbers, but in alphabet form. So guess what? Guess what? You asked and I delivered. I now have a letters to color stamp set. Now this is really fun. You will never find this font anywhere else. This is my font. I designed this font myself. I went in and created that A. I went in and created that B. I hand drew these letters. So it's kind of fun. So these are actually special letters to me because they're they're mine. So um, and not just a regular font. They're they're actually mine. So the fun thing is is they have those funny circles from the cake to build set. So you can um, they're not perfect circles, but they're fun to color. So now this is going to be one that you get to get it out your colored pencils or your Copic markers or any kind of marker you have. Use anything you like to color, um, or you could use the chalks or anything to color those little dots in. And you can expect to see this font a little bit more in the future because I really like this font and I can think of all these different, no, I just thought of another one. Darn it. Oh, my, my mind's always sinking. And as soon as I said that, I realized I thought of another one. Um, oh, I really did. Oh, sorry. Oh, I got to write that one down. I will, I'll forget. But um, I love this alphabet. So be prepared to see a little bit more of this one. But this one is going to be fun because you get to color in those cute little dots. And it's not hard to color them in because they're not too small. So don't worry. But this one's fun. Let me show you some examples because I have a couple. This one is by Beverly. And I love this one. It says Got Sand. And isn't this cute because she used our sand castle and our beach ball from our Summer for Fun stamp set. So I love that one. Now this one's by Beverly also. And I love how easy this one is. She used the Texture Boutique by Sizzix on this for the, um, the embossing on the background. And then she just stamped a quick high. Notice the whole theme of dots. We have dots on our letters. We have dots on the background. We have dots on the pattern paper. Isn't that adorable? Then we have this one. There's my zebra print. I love it. Here's a, uh, here's a texture impressions folder with zebra. And then she added, this is by Beverly. And then she added the zebra stars there. And it says, you are an all-star dad. Father's Day is coming up. So that's from our Father's Day stamp set. And it says, you're my star. You're my star. You're my star. Isn't that cute? I love that one. We have to save this one and give it to Kenny when, when it's Father's Day. <laughs> okay. This one is adorable using the All for Stars stamp set with that nice grid star. And then what Beverly did was she took from our dictionary stamp, dictionary for me stamp set, she took just the wish portion of the definition and she added that. And then she added the little star border right there. And I just think that's adorable. Now here's one and this one, I don't, oh, let's see. Oh, this one's by Kim. Thank you, Kim. And look how cute this one is. She added the zebra stars in there and then she added one of the bigger stars and it says, you're a rock star. My kids love to hear that. I always love to tell them, you're a rock star. You know, just because when they do something really good, you know, it's kind of fun. Now here's a star one and it is just all star. Look at that. I love this one. This one's by Beverly. And she added the stamps one, two, you know, so they go inside each other. And she added a star punch up here. So easy, but so adorable. Now look at this one. This one is by Laura. And she used the waffle cone from the cone to dish stamp set. And it says, got ice cream. And then we have, she cut, um, she stamped the outline onto pattern paper and then cut that out. And I think that is stunning. Isn't that adorable? But. The Creme de la Creme. I think this one is my favorite. And I already told Ken that we have to put this one in our booth, in our trade show booth, because it is so adorable. And it says, we all scream for ice cream. And this one's by Laura. But isn't it adorable how she cut out the little, the Sunday dish, and she cut out the little um, ice cream cone, and she added the little sprinkles on top. Here's the cute little spoon ready to go. And we all scream for ice cream. Now, isn't that stunning? It's so, and pretty easy too. Just a little bit of cutting and some stamping. Quick and easy and adorable. So I cannot wait for you to get these stamp sets in your hands because they're lots and lots of fun. Club members, don't forget any three stamp sets that you purchase, you get a free storage sheet to store your stamps in. So make sure if you're looking at some stamp sets, you know, order in multiples of three. So every three you buy. So if you buy three, you get one. If you buy six, you get two, you know, that kind of thing. Because it's nice to have those storage sheets to store your stamps in. 
and make sure club members that you log in to get the club prices as well. And um, make sure you check out our gallery because I've shown you some samples here, but there are tons more from our design team in the gallery. So just go in, click on that, and make sure you check those out also, okay? And make sure you upload your creations to our gallery because we're always doing gallery contests and I'd love to create a slideshow using your cards and I'd love for you to maybe win a choice of your stamp set sometime. So make sure you upload your creations to our gallery. Thanks so much and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. Yeah.